Well, several Central Texas cities hold so-called spring cleaning events this time of the year. City leaders in one town decided to get serious and take aim at blighted streets and areas. Dennis Turner explains why lots of people in Gatesville hope the town's code enforcement crackdown will strengthen neighborhoods. Justin McDuff will soon take ownership of this Central Gatesville home. And as you might expect, he has a lot of pride in his purchase. And we've got good neighbors moved in now, and so we're trying, we're, we're trying hard to keep this block and this little neighborhood decent. Just one little problem, though. The abandoned house next door. Its broken windows, piles of trash, and tall grass take away from what neighbors here have worked so hard to have. That's why the city of Gates will stepped in to lend a hand by offering some tough enforcement of the city's municipal codes. Lots of violations. We have uh, lots of building violations. We have tall grass, uh, lots of junk vehicles, um, just a bunch of metal junk, appliances. More than you thought you would see in Gatesville? Yes. For weeks, Corey Walters has traveled the town streets and he's found several property owners who need to clean up or face a ticket. He even measures the grass. Abandoned houses like this one with its half dozen code violations poses a special danger to the neighborhood. The kicked in door, that's an open invitation to animals and small children from the neighborhood. And the increased action doesn't just target one part of town. This isn't something we want to do at just one end of the city. We want to get off the main beaten path, take in the back streets, and clean the entire city up. Property owners will have to clean up trash and debris, fix their homes, and in one case, get rid of a teepee, or face stiff fines and penalties. Justin McDuff says it doesn't come a moment too soon. I think it's great that they're out here doing it. It needs to be done. There's a lot of houses that either need to be fixed or tore down. Because he knows from personal experience how just one bad house can bring down an entire street. In Gatesville, Dennis Turner, Central Texas News Now. Well, the crackdown should come as no surprise to folks in Gatesville. City leaders put the word out at their own spring cleaning almost a month ago.